Greetings, I am Cross Knights, and this is Let's Play... I keep on wanting to say Chrono Trigger. <laughs> Stardew Valley. So this one's going to be a tiny bit different in the beginning. I know that I, I did a whole thing about that structure that was rebuilt, but we're going to hold off on that because the votes are in. The uh, the Great Wife Off has, uh, has concluded, or I should say the Great Spouse Off, because uh, males were on the ballot. But, um, so I have the results. If you were looking at the comments at all, I think you know who won. I'm gonna go through the motions anyway, though, because, like, I said people... I, I'm trying to promote ranked choice voting here, and I just want to show what effect it could have played. However, ranked choice voting, by the way, has no effect if one candidate blows all the other ones out of the water. So, let me just go over people's first vote here. And how many votes were there? Let me see. I think there were 20... I think there were 34 votes, which is a lot. That's great. Thank you very much for everyone who voted. I really do appreciate it. Um, I should probably put a thing saying that voting is closed, but uh, I'm almost kind of curious. There's no way it's going to change, but regardless. Um, so let me just say all the candidates that got zero first choice votes. All right, no one voted for Alex, Sam, Sebastian, or Shane. The first choice. Um... So everyone, there's at least one vote for every female um, person. I do kind of wonder how Emily would have done, but she was off the ballot because I've already met her. I mentioned that. And I, I was actually expecting a few people to be like, Emily, but no. Thank you for listening. <laughs> wow, I somehow didn't notice that no one voted for Penny also. At least someone, someone actually did vote for Penny. However, they posted the comment around the time I was recording the video. But Penny did at least get one first choice vote. So yes, last place with a first choice vote. Elliot, I will say, there's only two guys that really interest me as far as characters, and it's Sebastian, who I rather he wanted to pick just because I saw, like, 203 play him so much. And Elliot, just because I don't, he, I don't know, he's kind of mysterious. I think he could have more depth. Um, but yeah, he only got one vote. Uh, then next with two votes, Harvey. Now, this is almost kind of fudged. Like, Budkiss kind of, like, changed his vote, and I don't even know if he meant to make Harvey his first choice, but I'm assuming he did. So I put that in there, and then Jesse said, you know, Abigail or Harvey. So, you know, I just put it down for Harvey. So it's like he didn't actually, he, he got kind of like wishy <laughs> first choice votes, but, you know, technically he got two first, first votes. Then we have Haley with three votes. Did better than I thought, to be honest. Um, I Someone did mention she has the most character growth. You are correct. She does have the most character growth. But, you know, I st ugh, she's just so, she's just so insufferable in the beginning. Maru with four first choice votes. Uh, Leah in second place with six. And then Abigail with 20 votes. <laughs> so in order for that to change, there would have had to be 14 people that all voted for Leah in second place. And that is not what happened. So basically at this point, if Abigail was your first choice, your second choices didn't matter because she already won. Um, if you voted for anyone but Abigail, your second place choice now count. Now your votes go to your second a candidate. So basically you eliminate all the lower level candidates one by one. You redistribute their votes. And this is how that played out. Um, Elliot got an additional vote, so he's up to two now. Shane got his first vote. Someone voted for Shane as their second place. Um, Maru got two more votes, so she is now at six. Leah got two more votes, so she is now at eight. And Abigail got three more votes, and she is now at 23. If anything, her lead just strengthened here, because a bunch of people picked Abigail as their second place vote. Um, I don't know. I <laughs> so most people's second uh, vote didn't matter because they voted for Abigail. Um, I will also note a weird phenomenon where every person who picked Leah as their first choice um, did not vote two times. Um, also, I should notice there was one vote for the wizard from my former roommate, um, which, <laughs> not on the ballot, but his second place choice was Linus, um, and then the dwarf, and then my horse, so, th sorry, Deg, they just, he just didn't take it this time. But I thought I would mention that, that, you know, essentially spoiled ballot. But yeah, no, Abigail. Abigail's it. Blew it out of the water. Now, I mentioned I was pretty sure I knew how this was going to go. I was correct. Um, Abigail just really makes a lot of sense because of... I mean, she's a gamer girl. We're on a gaming channel currently, and she has a poster of me on her wall, for God's sakes. My second choice was Maru. 
Actually, let me be honest. I think my first choice was Maru. But, uh, that's mainly because she looks like Luca. I think that'd be a cool Chrono pairing. I think she probably would be perfect for Chrono. Um, but I wanted to put it to her vote, so I'm happy with Abigail, because I am curious about her. I almost married her during my first run. So that's that. I, I'm pretty interesting. I'm pretty interested to see her events and stuff. Um, hopefully the, the stuff I've been doing in the background has been somewhat interesting, and I didn't trigger any events. If I did, I'm going to have to resolve those. But yeah, no, thank you so much for everyone voting. Abigail is it by a landslide. The other reason I was pretty sure about Abigail, I looked a long time ago at polls about who was the most popular um, husband and wife. Large margin, Abigail. Like, huge large margin. I don't even remember who the second was. So, yeah, gamers tend to like girls that play video games. Weird. And, um, the most popular male? Sebastian. Again, <laughs> he's a programmer. Yeah, it, and, you know, he's, he's also cool, and he rides a freaking motorcycle. But, yeah, that's that. Let me go back on to active commentary. So yeah, Abigail, I'm <laughs> and she's like the only person that I saw. Ah, ah it's Krobus. I oh, know, just one of his people. Um, so yeah, um, in addition, thank you to King Carrot, who, he was the first comment on my last video, and he said you have a uh, insect head in your, um, in your chest. And I did not remember that. I, I might have just floundered around, like, being like, Bleh. I didn't think I had any good items. So, oh, look at that, another egg. Um... So, because of that, I was able to go to the mines and go for Dust Spirits and Bats. Which I think might be my next targets. I'd love to go for the Skeleton Sacks, I just don't remember where they are. Um, oh, let me- I have a little bit of time, I can try to set this up. I should have done it sooner, but, you know. I thought the, uh, who I was gonna marry was more important. And I was gl I'm glad I was able to give her some quartz. I need to find some more Amethyst, so... That should- or- or I could do Golden Pumpkins, that'll actually be the fastest, I should do that. But speaking of which... We're just gonna take all of these out of the chest for no reason. I don't even have a lot of time to do this. Also, we're taking this. And I might as well take these along. An ancient seed. We'll take you too. Okay. And then we're going to go over to this building. Which I don't have a lot of time to set this up, but I'll do as much as I can. And I wish I had some torches. Do I? I don't... Yeah, I don't have any torches. It's dark in here. But yeah, this is a plot of land inside of a house that will grow any type of thing that can grow at any time of the year, including winter. Now, you understand how crazy that is. Oh my god, this is... I didn't realize this was... Did I never try to do that before? Jeez. Um, yeah, there's a third charge. How did I not try that? That's crazy. The third charge is just a block of... Uh, a block of nine, which is really useful, because then you, if you have, like, uh, anything, like, if you don't have iridium sprinklers, you just, uh, pickaxe the middle one, and bam, that's, you know, that's what you're gonna, I don't have to hoe all of this, though, now, ah, crap, I should have fertilizer, though, I shouldn't just, shouldn't just put things down, um, I mean, I could just do this tomorrow, but I, it would be nice to get something up tonight, since it'll, it'll count, you know, I'll get another day of growth, um, all right, all my sap, I don't know how much, um, space there is exactly, but, you know, a hundred of these will do. So, I mean, you can kind of just put things in there and ignore it. If you have one of the repeating plants, you're just kind of set. You'll you'll just get constant income from it. Um, but, all right, how, how do we do this here? Let's get my pickaxe. All right, bloop. And, uh, I don't know. Let's let, let me just fertilize here, and I will be bringing in torches so that I can actually see when I come in here. But all right, so I know all of these are gonna be is. Let's put down a nice. There's my sprinklers. Put one here, and then we want. I'm gonna screw this up, aren't I? That's good. That's good. And then here, so two spaces each. One, two. Three. Okay, and then there's going to be a row that's going to be awkward there, but I'll figure that out. Um, so, where we go? Fertilizer. Here and here. Actually, I'll just run down here. It's not going to fertilize places that don't have the properly hoed land. 
Oh my god, I just want to get this up quick, but... Okay, I'm about to run away, by the way. <laughs> Whatever, these pumpkins will just be earlier. I'm not gonna risk passing out in my greenhouse. Let's just get out of here. <laughs> I mean, I don't think it'll take me 20 minutes to get across. I mean, yeah, no, this is... <laughs> a bad. You wanna die due to my new hammer? Um, die quicker, please. <laughs> Alright, well now I might pass out before I get to the bed. Uh. Oh, alright, just made it. And that's how you utilize every part of your day. Also, my screen size is different right now, and certain things are being cut off. So I need to change that, but, uh, there's... I, I don't know if I mentioned it in my Stardew series yet, now that I think about it, but I have a new video card, and I have a new... It, the video card doesn't take an HDI cable. It did something weird to this game. That's why it's at a slightly different resolution. I'm in windowed mode, and I don't want to be. I think I have to take care of that. The sad thing is, I think this resolution will actually screw on the, fit on the screen perfectly. I already know how to make plum pudding. Bull. Um, but I just can't deal with the... Oh my god, they're ready. I can't deal with that right now. Like, I need a... Uh, did that just... Weird. Um... Yeah, I... Whatever. Let's see. Dear Chrono, I was conducting some field research the other day and I found this specimen. I hope you find it interesting. I should have gone to the thing first, because now I need to throw out you. Um, I meant... This is the spell that I was searching for all that time that's not even available at the time that I thought it was, but, um... Yeah, Demetrius sometimes sends it, sends it if I have, wasn't able to find one. Got one now, but I don't need them anymore, so... Pfft. You go away, you go away. Uh, I need that coconut, but I don't need it right now. Alright, Chrono, sorry to bother you again, but I need another favor. I've got a new hammer, and I want to try it on a variety of metals. Could you smelt an iron bar and bring me one? Thanks. Sure, i got some iron bars in my inventory right now, so I'll definitely take care of that. But yeah, these are finally done, and I can sell them. It's my inventory... F whatever. I better, I better just do the planting first, so that my inventory is full again. Can't pick up those, because my inventory is full... Okay, so, these have been watered once. All of that disappeared, I see, so I wasted some time hoeing stuff that I wasn't able to use, but... Actually, I shouldn't have... shouldn't have done it there. I could have done that all in one block if I stood in the middle. But whatever, I'm, I'm not losing a ton of time. Pickaxe the center. And, let's see... We want to do... <laughs> yeah, I lost some fertilizer. That doesn't doesn't really matter, though. I'll be able to... I'm not going to put anything on this bottom row just because of the way things are spaced out. I think that'll be fine. Oh, and I only have four pumpkins left. All right. So I most of my pumpkins got an extra day of watering. What else do we have? These are these are repeating, right? Uh, let's just put some potatoes in there. Because I know those aren't repeating. Okay. Now we're going to... Water... And this is just, uh, yeah, this is, I, I need to upgrade the watering can, but not quite yet. And plop. So yeah, obviously, this is why I wanted to get this building done as fast as possible. I could have had a massive source of income this entire time. Alas, didn't work out that way. Um, so right now, hmm, I want a place for repeating plants on the side. Also, to the person who uh, asked me if I can make my um, my plants more symmetrical because it bothers them. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I kind of like having a random crazy garden, personally. I mean, I understand how that would uh, screw with some people, but... Um, so this is quick grow. That'll make things grow faster. And that is really good to do for repeating plants. Such as grapes... And cranberries. Because that'll, you know, it'll, it's permanent. It'll keep on being better forever. It'll keep on being faster forever. Um, so those might be there for the rest of the game, unless I decide I need more space. I don't know. <laughs> we shall see. Yep. I can just smash it now. Then it won't be there for the rest of the game. There's the grow, and boom, boom, boom. Now that's actually in an awkward place, but... In fact, it should have been down here. Whatever. I can't destroy it now. <laughs> I don't have the things for it. Um, 
There's my watering can. Alright, one time watering of all these. I say one time because sprinklers should take care of the rest of it. Good. Um, let's see. What else do I want? Oh, I haven't... Damn it, I have another grape plant. That is awkward. Uh, I'll just throw it out. I don't want it. <laughs> I messed up everything. Uh, I don't know how I did that in my head. We got more potatoes. Is that all I have? Oh, I have an ancient seed. I need to put this in a place where I'm going to remember where it is. And I'll put some nice speed grow on it. Because these take a long time to grow, if I remember. All right, ancient seed planted. There we go. There's where it is. And... Ah, oh, what the hell. It'll be annoying, but... Yeah, no. Not symmetrical. Sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't even intentional. I just messed up. Also, this is better fertilizer, and I should have used a better fertilizer. What was I thinking? I forgot I had it. I forgot I took it. Um, potato seeds. So we want there, there, and there. Now that'll sprinkle all of those. Yeah, and then I can have another row down here. I don't think I have any other seeds to put. Actually, I have um, I have sunflower seeds. We'll put them up. All right. So. I mean, I don't really want to waste the really good grow on uh, on lower level plants. Or the really good fertilizer. You want, like, the crazy plants to have the best chance of getting uh, gold. One time water. It's already, uh... It's already to the point where I don't think Clint's gonna get his uh, iron bar today. Unless I meet him at the bar. Also, if I want to get more seeds, I can't. Because <laughs> it's Wednesday. And, uh, Pierre hates money. You think he would love money, the way he talks, but he actually hates money. Although, whatever, I shouldn't have expect him to work seven days a week. That would be crazy. Although I know there are people who do that. It's just, I, I feel bad for you that you have to do that. I don't think anyone should have to do that. I understand some people want to do it. I just don't think anyone should have to do it. Um, let's put you there. Yeah, I am out of seeds. So let me get my Iridium Sprinkler after harvesting all of my... Wonderful crops. I might as well actually. How much inventory space do I have? Not a lot. All right. Um, you know what? Let's just let's just blitz over to to Clint. I have time. That that's gonna be my focus today. Yoink! 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 Maybe I'll bring him a gold bar also. But yeah, the the issue with my recording, I'm pretty sure, was that my fan on my video card was dying. So that's why it would the, the thing would like suddenly slow down and then speed it back up. I, but now with this video card, I'm having like weird jumps constantly. Um, whereas the other time, you know, with the other uh, video card that was like dying, it was running perfectly all the time. So it's a little bit weird, but I don't know what to do about it. Will I make it? I think so, but you never know. I don't have a lot of time. Woo! Right, we're going up. We're going up. Hey, Pam. I don't think I, <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna go there. I'm still mourning the loss of my obsidian sword. I could get a lava sword. It's better than the obsidian sword, but that is—it's a rough thing. All right, let's process the geodes real quick. I cannot see the bottom row of my inventory. That is unacceptable. All right, we're changing the resolution right now. Uh, that's terrible. So I've now zoomed out a little bit. I, there, apparently, you can add zoom buttons to so zoom in and out. Um, I—I I actually had a plan to zoom way out during, um, the second season. And I still might do it. I've never played with the game zoomed out. I kind of like it close up. It feels more personal to me. But, um, I mean, now I can see things better. So, that's the thing. Here you go. Hey, that's the iron bar I asked for. Looks pretty strong. Perfect. Thanks, Chrono. I appreciate this. Is that the voice I gave him? I don't remember. Um, also this. There you go. That's exactly what I was looking for. Yeah, that's, that's around the voice I gave him, right? Now, did I manage to not bring the Omni Geode? <laughs> Whatever. I do have one more thing for the, um... For the museum that I found while fishing. I don't know if I showed that or not, but I might have. I'm not gonna give Abigail a gift right now. I don't think I'm close to, a, a new week. I hope I'm not. Oh my god, and I haven't been checking the calendar. What if it's someone's birthday? I definitely could have missed someone's birthday. Alright, well, I'll check that right now. I can't, I can't do it. It won't let me do it. <laughs> I just put it there. It's not where I wanted it, but... Um, at, at the very least, I need to... Oh my god, my mouth... 
<laughs> I hate windowed mode. Did I just give her something? Son of a bitch. I totally just gave her something by accident. That is terrible. She didn't like it. I think it was a... I don't know what it was, but... Not what I wanted. Thanks, mouse. <laughs> I hate you. Oh, my God. I can't believe that. Well, that sucks. So now she's gotten her two gifts. I'll just try to make sure to talk to her every day because I'm very close to getting her to eight hearts. Um, and because of that, I will be able to date her soon. Same thing every day. Yeah, no, I know. It's a daily grind, man. Um, corn? Does corn make it better? <laughs> Does corn make better? Oh, you actually said, what do you do for fun? Hmm. That's a good question. I like sleeping. Oh my god, I swear like half the people in this town have depression. No, don't go in there. Oh. <laughs> I could have talked to her. Um, Jody wants a red... I mean, I don't, I'm not going to find one of those. Oh my god, it's the Wither's birthday. I'm so glad I checked. I am going to give him a nice dark essence. Hey kid, what are you up to? Just passing the time as always. Yeah, look, I swear, like everyone is just depressed and bored. But she has a job, so... But her job consists of waiting at the tra at the bus like every day in the snow... Um, and then maybe I'll come by and give them some money, but I usually don't. So that's a pretty, that's a pretty sad job when I think about it. Um, all of these, I don't value these as gifts enough, so they're going away. The, the flowers I like, I might as well keep the flowers, especially when I go to the desert for Sandy. I forgot about, uh, getting the new, um, the, the upgrading my sprinkler it just didn't even occur to me. My sprint, whatever. I can't even think right now. Um... Pop. All right, you're coming with me. I'm gonna go. I haven't taken care of the animals yet, have I? Do 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 do. All right. I call that two cheeses. I love goat cheese. Wish I could have it more. It's just too expensive. Okay. And I forgot about torches, but so the iridium sprinkler goes right. Invisible. Here it is. Right here. I'm gonna have to... Might figure out something else when the weather actually turns correct, but... And so that'll get all of those, and then for these I'll just, you know... That'll do those. Everything except for my ancient seed... Is set up now. So I don't even have to worry about coming back in here unless I want to plant more things. Which I do. And after this day, I'm actually going to screw around with the resolution. It may have those, you know, little black bars on the side again. Or, you know, there's still black bars. I don't know. I haven't I haven't edited this yet. I just noticed that when I had to put it windowed, it looked more uh, long, which means it probably fits better. Also, so hammers. Special attack that hits everything in the area. It's kind of why I wanted to get a hammer, just because I always, uh, you know, I always said I was going to do more things. Wow, I was just about to go to bed or something. I have to go to the wizard. <laughs> I have time, though. It's not like he's about to close. He's gonna be open for a little bit. Smash. <laughs> yep, just what I needed. It's not like I got an entire field of those or anything. And soon, um, I'm gonna buy some trees. The, uh, the fruit trees. Arrowhead. I'm pretty damn sure I've got an arrowhead in the museum already. Might want to keep that to, in the house to look cool, though. So let me just see how much he likes me now, the wizard. All right, so he's at, he's pretty good. But now that you're getting this on your birthday... You... You remembered my birthday? I'm impressed. Thanks. All right, giving him a gift today. I can't just give him another gift. Um, yeah, now he... Wow. He gained a lot of hearts there. So he must have been on the cusp of one of the other hearts. So he's now in the top ten of people that like me. Which is great. Damn it. I bet I bet if I gave Abigail that one thing, it would have been great. She would have just she would just automatically been like, "Yeah. Yeah, we should go out." Though she already, I think she already has a crush on me. I just have a feeling based on things she said about her her secret and what she's been daydreaming about. I don't know. That's what I think. Um, weep weep. Smash. <laughs> a rock. Thank you. Great. Just what I needed. So then, so all of this foraging, I mean, you could kind of say it was farming, because most of this is stuff that I grew on the farm that finally paid dividends. 
So there we have it. All right, day 18. Now that it's saved, I can mess with the resolution without worrying about anything exploding. So let's go do that. It's weird, though. I think I'm using the same resolution on my monitor, but when I tried to do it, it said not supported, which means, you know, it's bad monitor voodoo. Juju? Hoodoo. I'm watching too much Supernatural. All right, so the days of me playing Stardew in full screen have apparently ended. Uh, and the days of me playing in borderless window have apparently started. Which, it actually looks, you know, exactly the same on my end, but it's just weirder to minimize. I don't know what in hell is going on. No, I do, though. They they designed the uh, resolution the way you, like, change it, and it works poorly. And a lot of games, like, are guilty of this. Like, this is what you need for resolution changers. Um, if you're gonna change it immediately, you need something where it says, like, if this resolution doesn't work for you, uh, it'll turn back in 15 seconds, or if not, hit OK. If it works, hit OK. Um, but this game makes it so that you can't... The second you go into full screen, it goes into full screen. You don't get any any options. And, here's the worst part, you can't edit re what resolution you want the full screen to be in until you hit that full screen button, which makes it go into full screen, and then I can't see anything. So, can't use full screen anymore. I don't think it'll affect anything on your end. Bean hotpot. Oh. Emily says she likes that. Interesting. I know a couple of recipes that I send you to. Maybe it'll help you... Okay. Oh, what is this? Um, Chrono, this recipe of mine won first place in a cooking competition. Hope you like it. Thanks for being a friend. She just sent me ice cream. Dear Chrono, I would like to give you some information about the upcoming event, the Festival of the Winter Star. It's time for the community to come together and think back of all the good fortune we've had during the year. A favorite tradition is the secret gift exchange, where someone in town is randomly assigned to gift someone. On the day of the festival, everyone brings a gift for their secret friend and surprises them with something special. This year's your secret friend is... Major Lewis. Don't tell anyone. The feast will take place between... on the 25th. Okay. Awesome. Yeah, it's essentially Christmas, so I need to keep in mind that I have to bring a gift for Mayor Lewis. Now, the best one would be... A pepper, or a chili, or whatever the hell it is. A chili pepper. This. All right, so that's what I'm giving him. Hot pepper. I know that he loves it. Um, the Christmas present is not as valuable for gaining friends as a birthday present, but it's damn valuable. I, I kind of... It seems to make sense that it would be, like, more valuable just because... Oh, never mind. I was going to say because it only happens once a year, but all birthdays only happen once a year. So, it's just you can't choose who you, uh, give the gift to, so... Uh, since you can't target it, I don't know. I think it'd just be cooler if it did more, I guess. But, uh, alas. Alright, so as you can see, yeah, middle of winter, things are starting to sprout. Very cool. I should probably buy some more seeds. And I may, but for right now, whatever. Not even entirely sure what I'm gonna do today. But, uh, figure out something. Ah! <laughs> that tree wasn't there before, was it? I don't know. But yeah, I mean, there's even less to do on the farm now. I mean, I guess not really, because it's not like I was doing anything with those crops. But, uh, it's just the animals, which I've just taken care of. So, I don't know. Could go mining. You see that little jump? I don't know, you might not have. I don't know how, how visible it is in the recording. But, uh, things just jump a little. Oh, no, 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 I need this. I need to make void mayonnaise is what I need to do. I'm going to keep the goat cheese, I think. Nah, goat cheese sells for too much. I'm just going to sell it. But, yes, take the void egg and make void mayonnaise. Liked by one specific character only. But, you know, I gotta think about that one specific character. Now, the issue is, I could try to go to the crazy... The crazy place. Um, the the skull caves, but that would be very dangerous with my current weapon. Might try it anyway. I don't know. Um, I do think I want to upgrade my watering can, finally. Because winter... I mean, it's the 18th, yeah. I need a good watering can, or it's gonna be annoying. So I'm gonna want to upgrade this twice, actually. So, let's try not to blow all my funds on random seeds. 
And also, every single day, I want to try to find Abigail and talk to her, since I am now pursuing her. And I don't want to lose any friendship. That'll be taking me backwards, won't it now? Hey, Pam. Um, do I still have that coconut? Have I been carrying it around, or did I accidentally sell it? I wanted to give it to Haley. I mean, in my in my random pursuits of everything, I've been neglecting every other person in town, I think. But, you know, love is an arrow. It shoots doors. Uh, I don't know what that means. Abigail! Another year is almost over. It goes by fast, doesn't it? Not that fast. <laughs> I feel like I've been doing this for a while. Oh, by the way, I'm just giving flowers to your father and not you. Though I don't even... I'm not even sure if she likes flowers. Man, see, part of the screen is, like, slightly cut off. For me, it doesn't say welcome. It says welcome. <laughs> I'm Irrears. I carry Uli the finest oods. Like, it's just that part's cut off for me. I don't think it's going to show up like that in the video. If it does, I'm certainly going to have to do something, but... Ooh. Damn it. I don't know which one grows in the summer. Ooh, and a bouquet. That's how you show romantic interest. She's not quite there yet, though, I don't think. Because I gave her the wrong gift. She'd totally be there if I didn't. I know she would. I screwed it up. Yes, give me amazing tonics. Yeah, whatever. I actually kind of wanted to see Harvey. Oh, Harvey's not here. He left him. Oh, no, there he is. It's like he complete. I... <laughs> this hammer is dangerous. I'm just slamming on the ground constantly. Nutrition is important. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and home-cooked meals are the best. I got you. <laughs> hey, what's up? Nothing much. It's, uh, you know, just wanted to talk to you a bit. Also here. I know you like metals. I know it's not the best metal, but you do still like it. You can make a copper robot. Alright, I should have brought a... I mean, I don't have the geodes, whatever. It's fine. Um, oh, do you want... Here, have one of these, too. Just giving these away. <laughs> it's fine. Business has been slow lately. You should upgrade tools. I could use the cash. Sure thing. Uh, upgrade tools. Silver. Watering can. I'm a dumb. <laughs> yeah, that was definitely not the correct metal. But, uh, boom. There you go. See you in three days. Foo! Or whatever, two days? I don't remember. Okay. That's done. I kind of want to check the quarry really quick. Just to see the progression or degression. I guess I can't really degress. Nothing. It's all rocks. Depress. Not even worth my time to... P oh, there we go. We got an amethyst. That is perfect. Of course, it's going to be a little bit before I can give them to Abigail, but... Still. Perfect. How many mixed seeds do I have? I could actually plant those in the greenhouse without buying anything additionally. But I don't know if I want to deal with all that right now. I do... I think I am just going to go to the desert real quick. Just for the purpose of seeing how well I can do. Also, things are running slowly. Hmm. Was it not just my video card? Or is borderless windows screwing things up? I would believe that. I don't trust these borderless windows. But I can't believe the problem hasn't been solved with a new video card. Like, that's crazy. Alright. <laughs> I mean, this was the test. Stardew was the one that was giving me the most issues for some reason. Whatever, I'm still... Oh, no. Not again. No. No. <laughs> ah! I can't believe this is a good video card. So it's not the video card. It's not my power supply, because I replaced that, too. So if it's not a hardware issue, maybe it really is a, a, a software issue like I thought it was. Let's see if I can write it out, like in the old days, though. Ugh, the graphical powerhouse that is Stardew Valley. <laughs> it's gotten me again. Alright, let's just try this. I need to really make sure I don't die, though, of course. But... I could die, I suppose. I'll just be super duper careful. Like, the last time I knew that I was in danger and I kept on going. And then not only that, I went into a weird corner. But it'll be even harder to get away now th than it was before. So, I mean, I'm in way more danger. And it w it'll be harder to actually kill things. But, you know, this is what you gotta do. I mean, I don't have to do it at all. But this is what I want to do. Can I cut these down? I can. Cool. Not that I have a lot of inventory space. Maybe I shouldn't be filling it up with wood and, uh... And, uh, sap and whatnot. But that can be the first thing I throw out. Hey, there. 
Uh, the shady looking guy in the back? I'm not supposed to talk about it. Well, whatever. Here, have this. Because you absolutely love getting flowers from the valley. I wonder if I have one star with her even. No, I mean, as much as, I, as I've is, i been giving her gifts that I, I gave her two gifts that she loves. Yeah, you need 250 points for a star. And each of those gifts should have given her 100. Oh, she, she should be close. But uh, there were so many days where I didn't talk to her. She's lost probably, you know, a quarter of what I gained by giving her gifts. All right, let's do the stupid thing and come back to this. Oh, never mind. It's not stupid already. I could literally just turn around and be worth it. <laughs> well, maybe not, but you know, almost. <laughs> Got to remember the ticket cost. All right, hammer time. How long will it take to kill one of these little guys with this, I wonder? It's beating a slime to death. The answer is... a long time. <laughs> Alright, but here's the real test. At least if it splits, it's the real test. If it doesn't split, whatever. Yeah. Huh. It just sucks because the, the sword has the most boring attack. But the, the swords are pretty much universally better stat-wise. But, uh, actually, if I had a hammer, I might have been able to get away, because you can just knock them away from you and then start walking. Eh. Really want that little one to die good. Alright, and I got Iridium. Smash. Smash. Yeah, like, it's just the first, like, I'm already down to half health. Now I'm below half health. Yeah, out of my way, invincible beetle. Alright, so now we're leaving. <laughs> As I said, though, it was still worth it to come here. But, um, yeah, no, I can't. Uh, it's running weird again, even on the lower setting. Alright, recording. Just hold it together for the, uh, for this screen at the very least. Alright. So, I, got, I didn't mean to confirm that fast. But, um, got about 2,500 golds. And yeah, that's it for this episode, despite... I, I'm... I do not know what to do about my computer, guys. <laughs> I don't know how to fix it. But, um... You know, maybe I'll figure it out, maybe I won't, but... Oh, God, I... I don't get it. In any case, I am Cross Knights. This has been Stardew Valley. It's definitely running badly in the background, but you can't see that. You can just see my lovely patrons who soothe my sadness at a weird, jerky, confusing computer. Yeah, I know who I'm mailing. Abigail's the one. We are, we're going to play uh, Flute and Kazoo together. And, uh, I mean, I'm being presumptuous. Maybe she won't marry me. I think she'll, I think she'll say yes. We just gotta, we just gotta do the relationship thing a little bit first, I think. Usually don't jump from friendship to marriage. Usually. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. Thank you very much for everyone who voted. Sorry for anyone who didn't get who they wanted. But almost, you know, over half of you had Abigail as your second choice or first choice. So I think most people will be happy. <laughs> Alright, later.